Hey guys, this is some. Hey guys, this is some gameplay. Oh, I'm sorry. This is XI Spawn I from YouTube. And this is some gameplay from. that I used before. It was from a clan op. Uh, it's, you know, it's decent. But that's not what I want to talk about today. And look at this lost guy. I thought it was in my teammate. Uh, that's not what I really want to talk about today. I did make a video today, but for some reason I'm really excited. And I just didn't want my excitement to go. Because usually I'm just blah. So I just wanted to talk about some YouTubers. So there are YouTubers out there, right, that make videos and they make a lot of videos. Like, uh, what's his name? The one that makes three videos a day. You guys know him. I just <sighs> forgot his name because I don't really watch him. It's too many videos for me. But, you know, he's a good commentator. He's a good YouTuber. He's a good person. Um, you know what? Let me search that right now. I don't know how I could forget this guy's name. God. Oh, Wings of Re I didn't even search it. Wings of Redemption, right? So he makes he used to make three videos a day, and he's getting tired of it because you know he plays. He spends 15 hours a day in his room uh, making videos, and you know I don't blame the guy. You know, he's very talented. But um, yeah, that's he's he's very devoted. He makes videos about everyday life. What happens? Of, and what happens? I th I respect him as a person. Uh, he's a very good person from what I see. He makes good videos and stuff like that. Uh, what is Gamertag? He he makes video. He makes a living off uh, of uh, what's it called? Gaming now. As a Call of Duty player, I don't think he's a good player. I think he's a he's like me. He's a decent player. If I versed him one on one, I would probably come close to be to me. I could be able to be him. Uh, the phone. Fourth time today. The goddamn phone. It said 877, so I just hung up. You know, I don't care. But, um, yeah, so what is Gamertag? He makes videos nowadays that are... I don't know. He, his content is okay, but everyone listens to him because, you know, he's older. He has a wife. He has children, and he could give good advice. And I agree on that. That's why I like watching him. Uh, yeah, he makes daily videos. Then there's, you know, some smaller ones that all of you might know, like White Boy 7th Street, don't get me started on him. I just, I don't know, I don't like watching his content. I think he's a good, you know, person and stuff, but I don't like watching his content. Uh, but Green Goblin HD, if you guys don't know, Mr. Exquisite XBL, Xbox Live, that's what it stands for. Those two are very, I think they're going to become very big. They're, I've watched them since they, they were little, and that wasn't even long ago. Like, that's how good they are. They're amazing players. They always talk about gameplay because they're so good. And, you know, those types of commentators are not really commentators, but players that, you know, commentate here and there. There. But, you know, I respect them as well. Like, there's a lot of YouTubers out there that are big that I respect. At the same time, you know, a lot of people are complaining that uh, they, they, they don't reach out to smaller channels now in a way i agree with you guys because i'm a small channel but in another way think about it if you were a, a large channel right now you would think oh i would help smaller channels because you know i was once a small channel but at a certain point i'm not saying all of you but a lot of people are greedy and when you get to that certain point where you're so greedy that you don't even care to look at other people because you're so large and in the youtube business that you don't even need to help others you know you might become selfish and that's how some youtubers big youtubers are out there today so i agree with you guys but at the same time not always because some you big youtubers still help out us help us out bye and i'll see you guys later